Well, it, that has been a wonderful experience. First of all, sharing knowledge and sharing uh, best practices in innovation and education and understanding what is being done all around the world and also receiving feedback on what we're doing at Tec de Monterrey in Mexico and understanding what are the best things that we can incorporate and also what are the things that we can share and create collaborations with universities all over the world and it's been wonderful. Oh, it's wonderful. All people from the entire globe coming together and um, exploring ways on how to innovate the future and through research, which is wonderful. It's awesome. It has been awesome. Uh, many angles because first, I think we got to meet really wonderful people here. We got to network and we got to learn a lot. And so I, I think the exchange has been very uh, healthy. The exchange has been very enriching. Um, we like the food. <laughs> What's not to like, right? And we love the people in Valencia. Everybody is just warm. Excellent. It's, it's a wonderful experience. Uh, it's my first time here at Intet. Uh, and um, I love that there is uh, people from all over the world, uh, educators. Uh, it's a truly international conference. Uh, and you don't say that a lot about uh, other conferences. Um, and um, uh, I love the, the merge between uh, technology and education. You can see that in all the uh, themes here at the conference. So. Amazing. It's exceeded my expectations. There's just so many people from many different countries. I work on transnational projects with other educators to train pre-service teachers. And I've already made so many contacts that I can then begin to do projects with, such as eTwinning and with Erasmus Plus. So it's been an amazing conference. Participated in many sessions yesterday, and everything was really uh, interesting. Uh, I, I learned a lot, uh, specifically on uh, on the use of AI in education, in education, and in, in different educational environments. So with the online uh, program. You know, you're able, like, I, I created my own, my own program and I know where I want to be at what time. You know, it's all here on my phone because of the online program that, that the, the conference has, has put in place. And of course, I like the food. <laughs> you know, it's, it's, been, it's been nice having these teas in between. The lunch yesterday was amazing. So I think a big ups to the conference organizers because I think they did quite well. I have to say that first of all, the keynote speakers were amazing and it was fun to also meet them later and establish collaborations, uh, both with Mike and Sarah. And um, secondly, the capability of creating this network, this global network of, of educational innovators. Uh, the conference is uh, um, really very uh, colorful and uh, I really like the, the variety of talks we have here. Yeah. Uh, about, the, about the venue, um, I think this venue is great. Um, the host was uh, great and the food was fantastic. Right? So I went to uh, pick up some of the local food, uh, like a paella. Yeah, so, so that's something new for me altogether. 100% uh, uh, perfect, great. I'm very impressed with the individuals that are organizing it. It's very professional um, and the food is amazing. <laughs> The hotel venue is great, and what's not to love about Valencia or Intet? Yes, this is actually our second conference with Intet. The organization of the event has been amazing, from the uh, um, interactive sessions to the uh, uh, conferences to the networking sessions to each of the lectures and the keynote speech. Everything has been very uh, organized and I think I can give credit to the organizing committee of Intel for doing a really good job here at Valencia. My experience is very um, uh, interesting and useful because there are very uh, different uh, sessions with a lot of uh, the latest technology about how to use uh, uh, technology in education uh, and also uh, some of the most uh, hot topics now, such as the uh, artificial intelligence in education, uh, integrated education, such as STEAM education or online learning after all the COVID situation. It has been an eye-opener in terms of the possibilities and opportunities that we can help our students with. And I think that's precious 
<laughs> and hopefully we'll be back in, uh, together with a bigger team in 2025. It's been very flawless, it's been very seamless, it's been uh, really well organized and uh, I hope that we will be able to come back again next year and with even more colleagues from Mexico.